In four easy steps, this video shows how you can build and manage your own database of quality carriers as part of the Full Circle TMS Build Your Own Load Board program and completely eliminate the need for any other load board. Every broker wants to deal with carriers who have high quality, high trust, high safety, properly FMCSA authorized, properly insured, and provide fair prices. To this end, brokers will spend a lot of time and money vetting their carrier database. Yet, when they post a load on some outside load board, they will get bids from carriers they don't know or trust and waste time filtering the good from the bad. When brokering, the 80-20 rule applies. 80% of your business will go to 20% of your carriers. That small group of carriers that meet your quality, trust, safety, authority, insurance, and pricing needs. Wouldn't it be easier and safer if you could just deal with those carriers you already vetted and know and trust? Then add to your trusted list when and if needed. In four easy steps, this video shows how you can build and manage your own database of quality carriers as part of the Full Circle TMS Build Your Own Load Board program and completely eliminate the need for any other load board. Step one is to set up your company sharing rules. This defines how you let other carriers in the Full Circle Network see your posted loads. Go to the Network tab and then the Sharing Rules left menu. This screen will show companies you do not share with. To share with all these companies where the rule is not set, simply click the Set Everything to Yes button. Otherwise, you can individually set the rules. In particular, you would set Can they see my loads I post on the Full Circle Load Board to either Yes or No. Do I want to see their assets or trucks when I do a truck search to yes or no? If you don't want to share, set the values to no. This is a way to block a carrier from seeing your posted loads on the Full Circle TMS load board or receiving posted load emails. Full Circle has specific entry requirements for new carriers and we try to build a quality carrier network, but it is still up to brokers to vet these carriers based on your standards. To see the companies you already share with, change the drop down at the top from Rule Not Defined to Rule Defined. It's very important to note that if a company is defined as broker only, they will never see your posted loads. This is a fail safe built into Full Circle TMS that prevents brokers from reposting someone else's load. You can change the sharing rules on individual companies as you see fit. If you click the triangle to the left of the company name, you can see all their related business units if they are set as preferred, their DOT number, address, etc. If you see the join circles, that means the company is active on LoadLink. If you are on the enterprise version of Full Circle, when you broker a load to a LoadLink carrier, it will copy the load data into their order system, and as they run the load, it will automatically update your order. Load link provides full visibility between broker and carrier. If you see the TINA symbol, that means the company is a TINA member. Once your company's sharing rules are set, anytime you post a load on Full Circle, people from the companies you share with will get posted load emails and see your posted load on the network load board. Step two is to define your list of preferred carriers. Start by going to the Assets tab and look at two left menu options. The Carriers list is a list of carriers that were created by Full Circle subscribers while using the TMS. This data is public information often copied directly from FMCSA which includes DOT number, MC number, name, address, city, state, zip, etc. The Preferred Carriers list is a subset of the Carriers list, and this is where you can build information that is unique to your company. The data you store with your Preferred Carrier list is not visible to any other Full Circle TMS subscriber. This is your means to build your database of quality carriers vetted using your standards. There are two ways to build your Preferred Carrier list. First, find each carrier in the Carriers list, for example, l and Transportation, Click the gear option and select Set as Preferred. This will add them to your preferred carrier list. The second way is to send us a spreadsheet of your carriers and we will import it for you. Send an email to support at fullcircletms.com and we will forward you this spreadsheet layout. Enter the data into the spreadsheet, send it back to us and we will import the data for you. If the carrier is not in the generic carrier list, 
You can add it by clicking the plus carrier button at the top right of the screen, enter the DOT or MC number and search FMCSA. Click the import from FMCSA button. Please make sure not to create a duplicate carrier record as this causes significant issues with everyone else in full circle. If you do find multiple carrier records in the database, please send an email to support at fullcircletms.com and let us know so we can remove duplicates. Step three is to set up your key carrier contacts and give them access to carry review and posted load emails. Unfortunately, there is no import function Full Circle can provide, so you need to do this manually. Go to the preferred carrier list, find the carrier in the link, drill into the carrier to open up the carrier profile. In the top menu, click the contacts link. This will list all the contacts, if any, that are stored with the carrier record. Click the new contact green button at the top right to open the add contact screen. Enter the first name, last name, email address, title, and preferably the phone number and cell number. Phone numbers are always helpful at 2 a.m. when trying to contact a carrier about a hot shipment. Set the has access to carrier view to be yes. Carrier view is a free portal that comes with the software. If you use our system to broker a load to this carrier, they can see the load details, see the rate confirmation, sign the rate con, do all the events like arrive, load, empty and check calls, upload paperwork and so much more via the carrier view portal. This will expose the next setting that says gets posted load emails. Set this to yes. This means whenever you post a load, this person can get a posted load email with the load details. Then save the record. Create as many carrier contacts as necessary. Basically, you want all the potential people at that carrier that can bid on one of your shipments to get the email. Once this is done, anytime you post a load on Full Circle, this contact email address will get a copy of the posted load email. Congratulations! You have begun building your own quality load board. Many other Full Circle brokers have already built their own private load board, so many carriers are already aware of how your posted load emails will arrive in their inbox. If they do not know how to bid on your posted loads, have them watch this video which provides a step-by-step -step instruction on how to bid yes. Step 4 is to set the carrier mode of transportation. This is an important feature if you want to segment your carriers to focus your posted loads to a subset of your carrier database. A little later in this video, we will explain how to customize your own list of modes of transportation. To set the modes of transportation, go to the Assets tab, Preferred Carriers on the left menu, find the carrier you want to deal with, drill into their profile. On the right side, drill down to the Modes of Transportation area, click the Add New, and add or remove any kind of mode of transportation that this carrier would perform. And then when you're done, save it. Make sure you add the modes of transportation column to the grid. To do that, go to the Actions, then Hide Show Data, and make sure that you have modes of transportation showing on the grid. Once it's on the grid, you can move it around anywhere you want, and you can also search based on modes of transportation. Show me all the carriers that do hazmat and our Tier 1 reefer and you can quickly find all those carriers. Once this is done, anytime you post a load on Full Circle and specify one or more modes of transportation, the posted load emails will only be sent to that subset of your preferred carriers. To see how to quickly post a load to your preferred carriers, watch this video. To get a list of people who get your posted load emails and their carrier segmentation, run any of these reports. To run these reports, go to the Reporting tab, the top menu, then go to Operations on the left menu, scroll down to find one of those four reports, then select your parameters of how you want to run it, and then run the report. Here is an example of one of those reports showing each user for each carrier and their modes of transportation. Full Circle TMS comes with a standard set of modes of transportation, but any of your administrative level users can modify or add to this list. Before you make any modifications, we strongly suggest you make a list of the most important modes of transportation for your company. This will save you from having to make significant changes later. To set your modes of transportation, go to the System tab, then go to Our Options list, select your business unit, scroll down until you find Carrier Modes of Transportation, click the heading once to open up the list of modes of transportation. To add a new mode of transportation, click the Add option, put in your name like Tier 3, Put in any documentation, give it a sort order which would identify where it's going to appear in the list and then click save. To make a change to a row, double click on the row, make your change, 
click Save. Be very careful if you change the mode name because any records that currently use the mode will automatically reflect your new name. Another benefit to vetting your carriers is the built-in 5-star review system. Brokers who use the Full Circle TMS Enterprise software have the ability to review a carrier after the carrier completes a load. This means the carrier's performance is measured on their actions, not on hearsay or emotion. The review is from 1 to 5 stars, where 5 stars is above and beyond the expected service. 4 stars is excellent, 3 stars minor issue, 2 stars major issue, 1 star catastrophic issue. The consolidated 5-star review from all brokers using Full Circle TMS can easily be added to your carrier and preferred carrier grid by going to the Actions tab, selecting Hide Show Data, scroll down to All Reviews and show that and save the changes. You can then move the column to where you want it on the grid. The number to the right of the review is how many times the carrier has been reviewed. If you mouse over the review, it will show their average rating. If you click the 5-star review, it will show their most recent 10 reviews and reason codes. Brokers can use the Full Circle TMS 5-star review system to augment their existing vetting process by considering how other brokers have rated a carrier's performance. It is another value-added feature of using the Full Circle TMS system to know the quality of a carrier based on actual usage. Here is a link to a YouTube video that explains the carrier review system. In summary, by following the four easy steps outlined in this video, your brokerage business can build and manage your own database of quality carriers as part of the Full Circle TMS, build your own load board program, and completely eliminate the need for any other load board.